Welcome to my channel. You're going to want to stick around to the end of this video because today we are busting through this wall, putting the door in. Once I start, I can't stop. So I have a big gaping hole. Rooster will be going in and out. Can't have it. Can't have it. So we're going to take it from about here. Actually, I'm taking all this out. It's got to have a stud put in here where I'm putting my door. And I am not looking forward to what I may or may not see once I'm inside that. And we're going to make a mess. Hello? Hello? Is anybody living in there? Hello? And right there we got a stud. So, yeah. I'm going to have to do a little bit of framing. See down in there? We got a stud right here. Look at that. Yep. And then if I turn this around, <laughs> he got another stud. Ah, just kidding. All right, guys. It's a cool day out, but I'm actually going to be in the house. I want to get this sheetrock out of here without making the biggest mess I can make. And this is the laundry room. I never show this thing, but it has never been finished. I've got this bed in here that has to go to the trash. It got wet. Uh, that time we had that storm, the bottom got wet. It also got wet uh, when it was in the fifth wheel. It's got stains all in it from that. No, I did not pee the bed. So we're going to get this. I've, I'm working. This is the temporary electric I've got run to the dog apartment. I disassembled all the cameras that I ran the other day. I only got two working because they were in my way. But I had to get that video done. So anyway, let's get to it. And let's do some destruction. Man, I like destruction as much as construction. All right, guys, let's go. Break on through to the other side. Break on through to the other side. Dun, 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 All right. Let's start gently removing the stuff. Get off me! Don't know what it was, but I don't want it on me. I'm gonna move you electrical. And I'm also doing a load of laundry, so hmm. Rooster. I'm not going to disconnect it. I am going to get it out of my way. Washing machine, what are you doing? I'm in the middle of a load. There's no way you're done. How could that be done? Yes, it is. All right. Now, this ain't going to work. This is going to my computer. I don't really want to disconnect it, but I may have no choice. Let's see. Let's get on up there. Stay out of my way. I'll leave you alone. You leave me alone. Now, this used to be a window. Now, I would have done a much better job filling this dude in. I don't know. I mean, this is just cheap plywood. Why would they do that? Why not put a stud right there? Sheet rocket. Don't know. You know. If you're gonna do something, do it right. Uh. Got my work clothes on. No, nope, not really. I slept in these clothes. Hey, it's comfortable, you know. And as soon as this door is in, I get this washer and dryer out of here, I'll get this room finished. So that's another project. I'm sick of projects. I want to get all this house done so I can go order my, my rocking chair. So I can have an old man's wife. I'm tired of doing all the working, but I do enjoy it. All right, we'll be back.
Now we got part of it cut. Now the door is actually going to only. I'm going to have to stu put a stud here, frame this out, because the door is not going all the way to this wall. I'm actually going out more here. Woo! And uh, I was worried about that bottom board there. It isn't rotten or nothing. It should be, but I guess they use good treated. Looks like a cedar. So I'm going to have a heck of a mess, but man, we got to get this out of here. We gotta get this in. It's sure a lot nicer to be able to walk in here from the house. I gotta be careful. I got nails. I ain't dressed for this. Woo! Yeah, it's getting a little warm, but you know what? I didn't think this out. Uh-uh. Because it's raining. Pretty good. And my saw is out there. And I'm gonna have to cut two by fours. We're gonna have to figure that out. If I have to, I'll bring them in here, cut them with a handsaw. Done it before. All right, let's get back to work, man. Okay, you can see the wall to the doghouse there. This is actually, I'm going to put a two by four about, it's going to give me about four inches here, all the way up. And I'm cutting this out to this line. I'm going to be out about three and a half inches from this wall. There's a stud there. There's a stud there. I'm just going to take the saws off cut through to that line both of these and I'm gonna try to remove this wall with the sheetrock and everything on it uh, I pretty much butchered that <laughs> I should have pulled this piece off I still might do that because uh, I'm not getting a I, I paid $30 for sawzall blades and they're still cheap man I tell you you can't get nothing good anymore so let me go ahead and pull that piece right off so I don't have to deal with it all right. six dollars a piece Chinese made crap that's we need to get out of China hundred percent do our own stuff again so aggravating pay that money and there we are a whole wall of mess and a little bit of mess all right I'm waiting for that little square butt to come through there at any time no water in here. Alright. This is my good tape measure. I need 34 inches. And so I need to cut a little more out. I'm going to leave a few inches here. I'll do a double stud. So that's going to be about right here. Yep. Cut another, I need to cut it down this line right here. Actually, I did go that far, but. Oh, oh, oh. keep a straight line with this saw or with this blade but I only got one left so I gotta make it work Jeez.
parsley, sage, rose, marion thyme. I've already done that in one of my videos. I gotta come up with new ones. That's fun. You can get out of here. Forty-year-old insulation. Woo! It's a toasted mold. I see you. Don't you even think about it. Do you hear the rain on the rooftop? Alright, blades, you gotta get me a little further. All right, I'm ready to start framing here in a minute. Common sense would tell me now would be the time to get that washer and dryer out of here since I get this big old gaping hole, but I ain't got the energy for that, man. The door will be plenty wide to get it out later, but I wish I could, but I'm not ready in here yet for it. And uh, I'll tell you what sucks. Should have picked these down before I started working. Uh, my new lamp still works. I could just hang it that way and you won't see the broken part. <laughs> or maybe I can order a new globe. I doubt it. Ah, oh, man. I gotta get find some 2x4s that aren't wet. That may be a challenge. We're getting some good rain the last couple days, man. Mowing time will be soon. Alright, I'm gonna go sit down for a few minutes to cool down. All right, I'm ready to start framing this door out. And yeah, look, look here what I discovered. Somebody wrote their initials down there. 81, 83, and 88. I don't know what that means. That tells me this out this this foundation probably was poured. I don't know. Is that their birth dates? If so, then this was poured much later than the house because the house was built in '80. That's probably their birth dates and their kids' names. One's a EU. That's probably Matthew. Alright. That stopped raining. I just got my little circular saw wherever I put it. Right there. And I'm gonna it, it doesn't need to go this high, so I need a frame across. I'll put a double header on there. And then this will go, another two by four will go flat against this. And then I'll frame this at 34 and 5 eighths. And that just gives me a little bit on each side of the door. And that's 85 and a quarter. And that's a little bit higher than that. So that's cool. And that's a little difference, but the threshold's hollow underneath, so it should shouldn't matter. So let me get busy on this. I'm fitting, I'm fitting to get busy. I know what them kids say today. Fitting. I'm fitting to get busy on it. I'm fitting. No, I will never say that again. Sorry. All right, there's a the stud right
double another one right there. Well, let's get this one in first before we do any doubling. You ever been to doubling? I haven't. Alright, man. Give your dog a bone. This soul may come around. Nick that patty white. Give your dog a bone. Oh, man, y'all gotta quit sneaking up on me like that. In the middle of busting into a song. Now, what am I doing? Alright. I don't remember what it was. 34 and a half. What? We'll remeasure, man. Turn this pan off. This pan, wow. Alright, I'm over here measuring the door. 33 and 3 eighths. So, I want to make it 34. Give me a little wiggle room. Got to have some wiggle room. Oh. Top. We can beat that dude over a little bit. All right. All I got to do now is I'm going to double this up on the back side. I'm going to get my measurements. We're doubled here. We're going to be doubled here. And then I'm going to run my header across. Double that. We're good, man. I'm going to slide that door in. And something here to patch that up. Well that'll be T111 later. Whew. It's going to be nice to just be able to walk in here. Right from my desk is right there. Nice. Yeah. We're getting there man. Now right, let's try this again. Sitting on my butt too long. That whole hot month. <laughs> I'm out of shape. Alright, I need AD2 and a Cortair. And I only got one 2x4 left, and that's going behind this one. AD2 and a quarter. And I'm not going to actually go up a little more. It will, too. Uh, going to have to go. And I gave myself a quarter inch room, so it'll go. Now, I'll get this one even. It's my dryer. And it ain't dry, trust me. Find my little level and I need it. Oh, it's up quite a bit. <laughs> Listen, buddy, I'm gonna have to put a screw in that one. Alright, guys, we'll come back when I get this framed in. Alright, when you're framing out a door, one thing you gotta make darn sure of is that they're square. Like that. Like that. Get those shade off. Nothing big. And level. That dude is dead on level. So that door should slide in here. As long as I kept my measurements this way, I'm going to double check them. 
34 inches is what I needed. There. Or 34 and a quarter. There we are. 34 and a quarter. No, what? 34. Yeah, yeah, 34 and a quarter. Okay, we got it all there. As long as you're wide enough to get it in, then you shim it up. And I didn't buy any shims. I'm going to find what I got for now. Tomorrow, I'll go to town. I'll get some shims. I'll get the proper stuff. Get the locks put on. All that good stuff. I'll probably put the locks on today. Hey, supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Even though the sound of it is something quite atrocious. Califragilisticexpialidocious. Ow! I'm gonna make it strong, and then there's gonna be pieces going across. It's gonna be going nigher and nigher everywhere. Sad week, guys. Wally died. Yep. Leave it to Beaver, Wally. We can't live forever. At least they'll have all them shows. People were, well, wait a minute. I'll have YouTube. If YouTube's around. Yeah. Like 50 years from now, they'll be looking, oh, look at that dog man guy. Nah, they probably won't. All right, that's strong. Strong, I tell you. Put a couple more down there. I'll spare y'all. Leave me bending over. All right. She's ready to receive the door. I'll put a couple of holders holder uppers that's what i call them because this door man you're gonna be going in and out it you don't want this thing look at this it's solid you don't want this shaking and shimmying and bopping and all that good stuff so this is all be covered i'm redoing this whole room once everything's out of here uh and no i'm not putting knickknacks on that as shelves i don't need shelves that bad and then over here i'll probably uh Put another two by four or something here and then this is going to be covered in t111 i've got two sheets of that left out there no that's the different stuff darn oh no i got a whole sheet there i think i'm out of that i'm gonna have to go to oklahoma because this has to match <sighs> i hate to go there for one sheet but all right let me get this atrocity of a mess cleaned up and we will put this door in all right moment of truth guys Carry that there door over here to this hole. If my ciphering was right, it'll slide right in. Maybe a little jiggling here and there. Oh, it'll fall on me. Oh, that's Lily. Let's just do it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, don't tell me it's too... Oh. Oh, oh, oh. That ain't no good. Get inside. Ah, dang, more stuff in my way. Looks like it's too tall. How could I? Um...
gotta raise up this end. <laughs> Makes me wonder. This door's out of square. I don't know, man. I've got that square everywhere. All right, let me make some minor adjustments. All right. See, sometimes before you start beating on stuff and cutting stuff, you gotta try other options. And all I had to do was take it on the inside. The fresh hole goes to the inside and the door is going to be flush with this, so that's all that's wrong. And the door is open. I hate you, Phillips head screw. I get in there. Let's try it again. shimmed in. I'm going to just put some temporary ones in there tomorrow. I'm going to get some real shims and get it done nice and square. I just want it to open. I'll probably put that lock on. Maybe not today. Uh, that kicked my butt moving that thing around. All right, let me just get her a couple screws in there to hold her in place and cover this up. All right, guys, the door is in. I've got four screws. i got one up top, a couple there. Just to hold it in place. Uh, I'll go get the shims tomorrow. We'll get everything squared up where it shuts perfectly like theirs does. I'm just going to shove a hole in that for now. Uh, I need to, nothing's going to come in there. I do want to shut that off with something. We do got snakes that could get in here. I'd hate to go sit on the pot tomorrow and have a snake sleeping in there. You know what I mean? Oh, it's been a long day. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you'd subscribe. Give me a like, give me a like, I don't care. But I appreciate everybody watching. We're going to do a lot of work out here this week, so stay tuned. Make sure you hit the notifications so you don't miss anything. Happy trading.